you doing the interview format here or you just want me to spew? So this is Jeremy in H6Z. He's going to show us about the new uh, Northwest Digital Radio products that were shown here at Microamps Digital Conference today. So go ahead, Jeremy. What, which one do you want to show us first? The first one that we're showing off is uh, the Universal Digital Radio Controller, the UDRC, which is a Raspberry Pi hat uh, that has a, an audio codec on it. And the primary market we're uh, pushing it into right now is in conjunction with the Yaesu DR1X uh, repeater um, so that it enables it to do D-Star as well. And we've got it mocked up here um, in an example configuration like might go on a repeater site um, with the uh, Raspberry Pi included. Um, and we will be shipping that hopefully before, the, uh, uh, before Dayton this year and we'll have them on sale there. What is the cable running in? From. The cable is running from the repeater. It'll have a 15 pin cable interface that will natively go to the uh, Yesu repeater and will ship you a cable with it when you buy it. It'll also have a mini DIN on it um, so that you can use it with any 9600 baud uh, radio that you've got with a data port on it. Um, and uh, you now don't have to use it for D-Star or anything like that. It's a, a standard sound card into the Raspberry Pi that you'll be able to use for uh, anything you want. We're kind of billing it as a, the signal link of the Raspberry Pi. Uh, where it's a really nice package to get a uh, sound card on it. Do this, yes. All right. So, and the thing that everybody's so curious about, the UDR-X. These are the prototypes of the UDR-X to kind of show where we're at today. Um, probably the interesting one here is we have uh, the UDR-X decoding 9600 baud packet. Um, I have a D TM D710 uh, transmitting APRS beacons. And we're using GNU Radio to uh, provide part of the signal processing. You'll see on the screen there's a GNU Radio flow graph uh, that provides the uh, FM uh, demodulation. Um, Direwolf is uh, providing the modem uh, uh, functionality of it. So uh, Direwolf normally is set up to handle the discriminator output on a standard radio. Um, so we don't have that on UDRX, we have INQ output. So GNU Radio is actually providing the equivalent of a discriminator output on the uh, uh, digitally into Direwolf. Uh, so we've got that shown off for the 9600 DMOD. Uh, we also have a demonstration here of another UDRX that is decoding D-Star. Um, and I have my uh, uh, IC51 um, that does uh, that's transmitting a D-Star signal. And if it works correctly, then you'll see, oh well, there we go you'll see the D-Star header is getting decoded off of the ID51. So tell me what's here on the table that's actually doing that, because that's different from what this we've is, seen in the past. This is the UDRX uh, prototype board. Um, that's our revision 3 prototype that's hooked up to a Raspberry Pi 3, um, and the Raspberry Pi 3 is doing all of the processing here. And what's the middle card there? Uh, the middle card is just a prototype adapter card. When the uh, UDRX ships, um, the UDRX will uh, plug directly into the Raspberry Pi. Okay. And software that's actually doing this? The software on there is, uh, again, GNU Radio to do a lot of the processing, um, but uh, DSD is providing the core of that, which is an open source uh, D-Star decoder. Um, and there's a guy that wrote a GNU Radio block that includes DSD, um, and that's what's doing all of the work in that. Cool. Thank you, Jeremy. Thanks, Kenny. Bye.